YouTube, this is Pops at Outdoor Projects with Pops and today I want to talk about building a forge. Um, I am in the process of building a knife out of a file and uh, the first thing I did was buy an old file from uh, one of the thrift shops uh, that's local in the area for like a buck and uh, I actually annealed it to soften it, uh, had to use an open fire in uh, one of my old grills I actually did the hair blower thing, uh, blowing heat into the fire, into the charcoal, briquettes, and it actually did heat up to a point where uh, it turned an orange color, was it uh, attracted to magnetism, and it actually worked. It softened it, but it took a long time. I'm, I'm talking about an hour or so until I got to that point. So I'm in the process of building a forge and uh, this one, uh, I just want to use briquettes. I really want to use hardwood, uh, charcoal that uh, either I make myself and I uh, actually bought some to begin with. But I've got a design where it's just simple. It's just uh, made out of bricks, uh, fire bricks, insulation bricks uh, that I can kind of put together. And the biggest part of this was actually making a blower system and uh, now I'll go back into my shop and uh, just kind of give you a video and show you what I've built so far. And then maybe uh, we can fire it up and uh, see what it'll do. Thanks. I'm back and these are the pieces to the uh, forge that I'm building right now. Um, I've got uh, some fire bricks. These are the larger bricks here. Uh, I think they're about 9 inch by 16 inch, very heavy, uh, got them at a uh, local uh, landscaping business. Uh, the uh, bricks were actually sold by a pallet uh, from a steel mill here in the city that I live in. And uh, here are some bricks I ordered online. These are some insulating bricks, uh, very light, very easy to cut, can kind of form them any way I want to. And those are really going to be the box. Uh, of the forge itself where I'm going to put the fire in and this is going to be a charcoal fire uh, what I'm going to try to do is make hardwood charcoal that's my ultimate goal um, every, the other parts I've got here are the uh, the blower just to, just to blow some air this is just an electric blower I've got connected to a PVC pipe and that PVC pipe will fit into this PVC pipe adapter here and I've got some uh, black iron that I bought. Uh, this is just about a 5 inch nipple, 90 degree elbow, uh, an 18 inch uh, black iron pipe here. And here every 3 inches or so I uh, drill the hole and that's where my air will come out when I turn on my blower. And to control the actual amount of air that goes in I uh, went and bought a uh, light dimmer and I made it and I'm going to restrict the amount of power or voltage going to my blower using this. I've uh, mounted it on a, on a block of wood uh, and you can, as you can probably tell this forge is going to be very portable. I can move it anywhere. Of course I'll be using it outside but I just got it in my uh, garage here just to uh, set everything up and uh, as soon as I set it up I'll uh, give you a little demonstration. Okay, I've got uh, my forge set up, and uh, of course this is going to be where the charcoal will going to go, and you can see the uh, black iron pipe uh, running through there. Now this here is about, uh, I think these are about 9 inches, about 18 inches from beginning to end right there. Uh, I can put another fire brick on top, uh, put some uh, insulating block over here to enclose a little bit. Uh, so. Uh, and then I've got my pipe running down to my elbow uh, again through the PVC pipe to my blower and I've got it connected up to a, uh, uh, a variable uh, light dimmer here that I've got and of course my extension cord is plugged in. So to kind of demonstrate the air that I can control out of this, it's pretty neat. I just got a piece of plastic here I'm going to put there and a little bit of weight here and just kind of give you an idea. And uh, I've got a uh, an actual, hopefully I can do this, I've got to reach a little bit. 
but uh, I'll go ahead and show you. Go ahead and uh, turn this on, and it'll probably make some noise. Very low to begin with. It's probably here right now, blowing. And you can see uh, the plastic moving a little bit. And of course I'll turn it up some more. And of course that's quite a bit of air going through there and uh, I think it'll work fairly decent uh, and again just to show you what I want to uh, to heat up first uh, I got a couple things uh, projects I'm doing right now uh, I think I showed you guys this knife before maybe not this is a knife I'm building out of a file I still have to uh, heat treat the knife uh, heat it up uh, harden it uh, temper it and then sharpen it up and uh, work on the handle some more and at the same time I think my first experiment is going to be just to go ahead and uh, anneal this uh, old file just to see how long it will take me to uh, to soften it up hopefully it won't take very long using uh, my contraption here hope you like it and um, I'll uh, post a second video on this when I'm actually fired it up thanks